Hey, hey, spring on face, simply tear it. We're going to try this again for the sign of Virgo. We just tried it and we ended up with a special message for someone. So we're going to try it again. We're trying to find out who's coming towards Virgo. It's according to, you know, as far as love is concerned. And I'm going to actually clear these cards right quick. Just a little bit more, a little bit further. Maybe that way we can see for all the Virgos who's possibly coming towards them. Yeah. Please remove all energy that does not belong. Okay. See everything. So, has everybody been going out? and taking advantage of the energy that's out at night because we have that full moon coming. The moon in Pisces. The micro moon. Awesome. I actually fell asleep about 7 o'clock last night so I got up bright and early, really early and still went out to enjoy the energy. And, um, yeah, awesome time to release anything that no longer serves you for your greater good or anyone. So, if something's keeping you stuck or burdened or in pain, it's time to release that. So you can go forth in your life. Okay, this is going to be for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Saturn. And if you don't know what all of that is, check your birth chart. You can do that on Astrolabe online for free and find out, you know, all the signs that are in your birth chart. Okay, let's cut. Virgo, Nine of Cups. Can you show me the love interest coming towards Virgo? Oh my goodness. I'm going to have to move those. Hmm. That's that one. The Fool. Oh, hmm. Can you show me the love interest coming towards Virgo, please? Can you show me the love interest? Is someone coming towards the sign of Virgo? Can you please show me? I feel like this is... This is new beginning. This is, this is like a... Something been wanted. This is starting over. See how it's a zero? This is like starting from new. Yes. 
a new a new chapter, a new journey, starting fresh, starting with a clean rebuild. It's rebuilding a foundation, yes. And we've got the chariot wanting to move towards something or someone. Someone may be wanting to come towards you. Or you want to come towards them, something or another. But I'm asking for people that's coming towards you. So, can you show me who's coming towards... It's our King of Swords in reverse. Hmm. Coming towards Virgo. Who is coming towards Virgo, please? Who's coming towards Virgo, please? Someone's been waiting on you. They've been keeping their balance. Wanting to come towards you. I keep getting drawn to the middle of the deck. Oh my goodness. I'm still going to ask. Who's coming towards Virgo, please? Is anyone else coming towards Virgo? Oh, why do I keep getting drawn there? Oh, goodness. Okay. Someone's harsh. Is this you? Or someone else? Someone stopped. They've just stopped. They found their balance. And they're moving away. You want a new beginning and you want movement. This person has feels like they've just stu they they've stopped. They gave up. They found their balance and they've moving away from the situation. I'm sorry, I'm drawn to the bottom. So I gotta look it over. Oh, okay. I gotta go with it because I've got this is what was on the inside this whole time. I've been drawn to it and drawn to it and drawn to it. Now it's on the bottom. This is the this is what's been offered. Someone gave up. To there was a broken heart. A lot of heartache. Someone wants to give emotions. Queen of Wands. I 
I feel like this is this is who's coming into your future or into your life. This is a parent. This is they've they've lived. They've learned through life lessons. They've See, there's two feelings to this, this one. There's the feeling that this could be your energy, but there's also the feeling of someone gave up. That feels different. Yes, yes. Oh. This, is, this is who is coming into your life, I feel like. There's going to be decisions having to be made. Um, really thinking, really using clarity, using your intuition. Feeling like, oh, <laughs> uh, what should I do? What should I do? Just kind of hanging on that not knowing. Go with the flow and follow your intuition This is you. This is your energy. Using inner wisdom. A sense of boldness. A sense of stubbornness. Yeah, I feel love there. I feel affection within the card. Hmm. I'm sorry. Just give me a second here. I've got to go over these cards that I'm seeing here that to see what Okay, I feel like that that is you. That is the energy I feel like you're taking on. Somebody gave up. This one came into it. I feel like it's letting go of past burdens with our Ten of Swords. We've got the King of Cups here. Someone else coming into your life. So there's two. This is what is wanted. The Four of Wands. No longer feeling left out in the cold. I sense because of our Nine. I'm trying to get this set up. Nine of Swords here. Feeling like um, I don't. I don't know if feeling left out in the cold is the right word. It's more like, what do I do? It's kind of like indecisive, like. With her hangman. Just, it's like, yeah, being in, in suspension. Not knowing, do I turn left? Do I turn right? What, what do I do? And we've got the queen of swords. If you were in the reverse where I thought this was you, that would be, you know, there's the counterpart coming into this.